Hi everybody, welcome back to my 100% walkthrough of Assassin's Creed Syndicate. In this video we are going to be doing the next in the train, uh, hi train hideout memories. This one's called Nigel in for the chop. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is go to the train. I thought we'd spawn back on the train as I left us on the train, but no, we're not doing that. So, Evie's going to walk forward and talk to Agnes. Nigel, in for the job. Nigel went out drinking with a gang last night. They ran up against some Templars and killed one. But Nigel was too sozzled to get away. Knew the constables have him up for murder. Okay, so Nigel's in trouble. Good old Nigel, eh? So first of all we've got to get to where he is, and uh, let me show you where that is, it's in the Strand, we're actually in the area that we should be in, it's there look. So take a carriage and walk, we'll get to there and then approach the carriage for the start of the mission. going to go bad for you, confess, and you'll save us all some grief. Oh, I didn't do nothing, so help me Bob! <laughs> Drinks. The next thing I know, they say I burnt someone. Oh, Nigel. I had one too many. I lost all my things. There must be scatters all about. Oh, and there's a knife out there, too. Could you get them before the Rosses do? Shut up! Okay. Now, we mustn't kill any police officers. If we kill a police officer, we will desync. We're not going to kill them. We're only going to knock them out. And we have to knock out at least four of them for the optional objective. So if you come around to this side, this is the easiest way of doing this as far as I can see. You can get these four quite easy. But this mission is completely about stealth. So jump into the hay and wait. And the police officer's around. Wait until this one goes from here. He's going to walk away in a minute. So off she, off he goes, and we're coming out, and then sneak up on him and take him out with a circle. Hold, hold on to it, and then bring him to the floor. That's what you do. That's one. Okay. And then if I were you, I'd head straight back to your hay. Get into the hay and wait. Now you're looking for waiting for the, this guy in the middle to keep out your way, but you're also waiting for this guy to turn around. Not him but him to walk along and look at some bushes or something. He's going to stop down in a minute. You can to see it. There he is. So we're going to zap over there now. The ones that have got their faces, their backs turned to us are not a problem, but this one is. So we'll take him down. We're going to take them all down now. Because that will give us our four. That's two. I'm going to wait for this guy to wander back around again, which he will do in a moment. Takes his time, but he will do. Make sure you hit the right button though, because I accidentally hit the square button when I was practicing this. And it kills him, and then you desync. Okay, so we go around here and try and get him. Do you see us? Oh! Now, he shouted, but no one heard him, and I'm managing to put him to sleep quickly enough. That's good news. Okay, so that's three of them. And this will be the fourth one. We'll just take him out. None of these guys do this about it. It's quite amusing. They're just watching me wrestle a policeman to the floor and they do nothing which I think is quite good and there's the four done so we don't have to wrestle any more to the floor we can just go and do the stuff but it's safer if we do take these guys out for later on much safer so we'll take this one out just like that and then there's 
there's one other one on the other side. And we're gonna go and take him out too. There he is. Let's take him out. Job done. Okay. Now having got rid of them all, we're gonna go up and dispose of the evidence that is there. That's the first one, it's a hat, look. So we're gonna lose that. Next we're gonna then take off our hood, lose the self area and go over it through this building and into the next one. Okay, so now we're on on we go with the next bit. So get ready with Keep an eye open for these. As we're going to hide in here for a minute. There's not so many um, police around here, although there are quite a few. But we should be able to get in and out of here quite quickly and easily, hopefully, to get to the next bit of evidence, which we can see is over there. Okay, so where are we going? How are we going to do this? That guard's not going to move. He's not that one is so and the evidence is over there so we're gonna have to sneak our way over so I'm back into sneak mode Ooh, might time that just perfectly it almost wasn't perfect was it okay so we're gonna come down here and watch out for this guy coming around we'll just hide behind here for a moment while this copper comes back around here I'm gonna sneak around in front of him oh but luckily I got a punch in before she, he did anything with it, so that didn't quite go to perfect plan, but no one's come to help him, and he's now been put to sleep. Okay, so we're going to go in through this way now, and then in through this door. Oh, oh, there's another one. Oh, that's not good. Oh, got away with that. I'll stay stealthy. And when he comes out, punch him. And Quiet and I won't hurt you. We've kidnapped him, but we're not gonna do that. We are actually going to put him to sleep. And he is asleep. That's good. Now there's another copper over there, look, by by the gate. We're gonna wait for him to walk away. And he has. Now we're going to go after him. But before that, we're going to destroy the evidence, which is a cleaver. We're going to take that with us. All right. Now we'll go this way. To the end, end of the road, and then take him. And put him to sleep quickly before anyone else comes along. He's asleep. Right, okay, so one more piece of evidence to get rid of. Stay nice and stealthy. We'll go back the way we came because we know the guards have been taken care of, right? So we keep going. And uh, keep going again. In fact, actually, we're between. We don't need to be stealthy through there, do we? We can take off the, the hood and not look so suspicious until we go into this bit here which we're gonna do now back into the self mode there's a guy over there look and he's the only one in here the other one is outside so we can go straight in here and put this guy to sleep which we have done and then we can destroy the next bit of evidence which is some bit of paper and that's gone as well now there's only one more thing left to do to, to save Nigel and that is we need to dispose of the body so we're going to take him down there we go that's him down. Climb 
one over the fence and get ready to go stay in stealth mode in we go I think there are two guards in here that we need to sort out this one is the first he's going to wander about oh, he's going to go up through the gate and round so in which case we can come round and take him too Ooh, here we go that guy's going to run off scared we keep going and then we're going to come back through here and get this police officer here who is standing there take him out as well nice, he really doesn't well, they're not killing the police so I'm only trying to rescue them. I'm only trying to rescue their friend so they're um, um, pick up the body and start walking with them okay so in we go to take the body to a hiding place I took it to this one drop him in there and then all you've got to do to finish this is go back and talk to the police inspector which we will do now so run back and if I were you I'd just retrace your steps the way you went uh, through there through there past these people back through the doors that we came through earlier around uh, Cross this bit, out past these people, and then round to your left to talk to the guy who is just standing here. Approach them and speak to the inspector. And what evidence are you holding this man? Why on, uh, uh, Sergeant. I believe at a minimum you need a body. We can't find a thing, Inspector. You botched another one, Sergeant. And that's it. That's where we're going to end this video. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, it's bye for now.